The wind blew off the desert, as it almost always does here in Riyadh, so it was a testing opening day in the Saudi Open, presented by PIF. Not a great day for Andy Ogletree, last year's Order of Merit champion. Four bogeys and a double on his card. He would finish over par. Henrik Stenson was runner-up in the last Saudi Open in December. 69 today for the former Open champion, with the help of this birdie yeah! at the seventh. Thank you, Henrik. And it's good to see Kiradek happy barn rat back to his best. This a birdie putt at the fourth for the tie, a round of 68, and he's on three under par. Current order of merit leader David Pugh looks to have things very much under control, particularly early on. This was his second into the seventh. In the end, a double at the 16th was disappointing, but still a round of 67, so he's four under par. Japan's Tatsunori Shogenji. This into the second on his back nine. Beautifully played at the par five. He would hold the putt. Shogenji with 66 for five under par. Justin Kiban of the Philippines, another man who had a good day. This at the fourth. Beautifully hold. He too at five under after 18 holes. Wade Ormsby's had a tough start to the year. But it's all beginning to come good. This at the fourth, beautifully judged birdie putt. Five birdies, no bogeys. 66 for Wade Ormsby. And his fellow Aussie, Scott Hand, he's already won as a senior golfer. But don't worry, he's still competitive among the youngsters. Lovely birdie at the 17th. 66 for five under. He's only one behind. But the man who leads after 18 holes is the man who shot 59 and won in Macau last time out. John Catlin of the US, a birdie at the seventh, 65, he's six under.